I grew up with a grandmother who was blind. She didn't see any of her grandchildren, and she had many of them, more than 37. Her biggest wish uh, as we were growing up was to be able to see us just once. Um, and every year she wished for that, and every year I wished for that. I, in fact, remember trying to twitch my nose like Samantha from The Bewitched, completely convinced that I could change the course of her visual acuity. My name is Parissa Zamiri, and I am a translational medicine expert in ophthalmology at Novartis. I went into medicine with a complete heroic sort of ideal that I will be there and you know some new discovery will take place and it would be great and people would be saved and particularly as an ophthalmologist I found it extremely frustrating to have my patients come to the clinic and for so many of them uh, there was no treatment. I couldn't believe that there was nothing we could do. I wanted to be part of a solution and that prompted me to join an industry where you could actually really do translational medicine. In my research, I concentrated on immunology of the eye. Now I work on age-related macular degeneration and I'm hoping with understanding the disease better, we can provide a treatment uh, to um, at least slow the progression of this disease. As a translational medicine expert, I have this exciting opportunity to sit from the beginning of where the molecule is being discovered and watch that pass its uh, safety hurdles, then design it in such a way that it gives me an answer. Does it work? Is it safe? It's much more complicated than it appears at the beginning. So it's not about, you know, you make this drug, give this drug, and this drug is going to solve the problem. The disease is often multifactorial. The, the treatment also has to be. I am very passionate about what I do. I was very passionate about getting into medical school and, and then into ophthalmology. And now I am accused by, by my children, at least, of um, you know, going to bed, not with their names on my mind, but the name of the project that I'm working on. I think about the projects all the time, whether I'm at work or not. And I mainly do that because I want to get a treatment to patients as soon as it's possible, as long as it is safe um, and effective. The suffering that I saw my grandmother go through and the patients in the clinic when I was practicing uh, is a constant fuel and a reminder to me to move faster.